hey everybody welcome back again to my this channel and to my new video in this video i will show you uh complete rpcs3 uh, opengl configuration settings to get more performance uh, while using opengl in your rpcs3 so let's start first of all guys uh make sure uh, uh, you are using latest version rpcs3 so go to help and check for updates if you have older vision rpcs3 then you can face a lot of issues uh, while using rpcs3 with opengl so check for updates after updating your rpcs3 uh, you will need some more settings for your rpcs3 if you want to use opengl and if you want to use uh, configuration uh, settings for OpenGL so go to the game you want to play in your RPCS3 right click and change custom configuration guys uh, do not skip any part of this video if you have AMD GPU then you cannot fix uh, many issues uh, while using OpenGL if you have NVIDIA GPU then you can uh, you can fix many issues uh, uh after some settings uh, in your rpc history if you want to use opengl so uh, i have nvidia gpu so if you have amd or intel hd graphics then uh, you can face a lot of, a lot of features uh, while using opengl in rpc history so go to your cv option and select this one uh, recompiler asmgit and select this one and enable spu loop detection and select mega from here and select four from here and go to gpu option select open gl from here uh, uh, if you have an older uh, version old gpu device old graphics card then you cannot use a vulcan uh, because old uh, graphics card does not support vulcan so you have only one option for uh, OpenGL to use in RPCS3. So, uh, for those people, for those users uh, who, uh, who can use uh, OpenGL in RPCS3, uh, select Renderer OpenGL. And after selecting uh, OpenGL, select Frame Limit up from here and uh, Default Resolution. Select Recommended. If you select this one, then you can face another issue so select recommended from here and resolution scale uh, this one and select port from here and check this option uh, multi-thread rxx and select this one and share the quality high and 3d disabled by default and audio options Check this option and you can select 120 or 25 or uh, 150 from here and go to advanced options and over here you can see driver wake up delay select 400 or 300 so 300 us apply and save custom configuration right click and change custom configuration again advanced option and debug console mod check this option if you are uh, facing crashing problem so you can select this option debug console mod uh, and unlimited from here uh, if you are uh, facing black screen and graphics glitches uh, after selecting the numbers then you can select unlimited default and yep check this option and okay all settings are completed from your rpcs3 now apply and save custom configuration now you will need some more settings from your gpu device you are using so i have nvidia gpu i go to my nvidia control panel and make sure you are using latest uh, drivers for your GPU device. I go to my device manager and if you cannot install latest drivers for your GPU, 
so then you can use OpenGL. So drivers, you can see driver date. So I'm using uh, latest drivers in 2023. If you have older vision drivers, then please update drivers for LGB device. And uh, after updating drivers for LGB device, you will need some more settings from your uh, uh, NVIDIA control panel. Select performance from here. Check this option and apply. And go to manage the settings over here. Uh, but first, go to configure around and select your uh, uh, GPU device. If you have uh, internal GPU device, then you can select CPU. And if you have external GPU device, then you can choose your GPU device from here. So I have external GPU device. After selecting, uh, click on apply and go to configure around. and scroll down and open gl rendering gpu you need to select your gpu device from up here so this is my gpu device and open gl gdi compatibility select prefer performance from up here uh, this one and yeah publish management mode select maximum performance yeah and uh, texture filtering quality select performance or high performance from here and scroll down and vertical sync should be off from here and scroll down and Vulkan or OpenGL select this one and click on apply and now go to program settings to select your RPCS3 application file Program settings, go to add options and browse, go to your uh, RPCS3 application file. So my RPCS3 uh, uh, over here in uh, desktop. Right click open file location and select this application file. Open and Uh, click on apply and it's done uh, settings uh, for your NVIDIA control panel are completed now now close it and uh, if you have the Windows 10 or 11 then right click add go to display settings to get more performance while using OpenGL in your RPCS3 cool graphic settings delete your uh, remove your old RPCS3 application file remove browse and go to your rpcs3 application file and add options and options high performance and save and it's done now guys we are ready to play any game in rpcs3 with opengl and i hope this tutorial will be helpful for you guys if you like it then please subscribe to my this channel and thanks for watching bye bye see you in the next video